do you know why <clears throat> the Asians, especially the Japanese, do you know why they do not shake hands? Because shaking hands causes or transfers spiritually. This whole life we're living is spiritual. This life is spiritual. It is the spiritual realm that controls the physical realm. So, every individual, every human being, every person you see has an aura that surrounds them. All right? An aura is another thing called energy. There's an energy that surrounds each person that you see, you pass, that you interact with. Some auras are good. Some auras are, they are demonic. Some auras are deadly. Some auras can suck the life out of you. So if you cannot see in the supernatural realm and you just you are just akin to shaking hands with everybody that you meet and you come in touch with a deadly aura, that person shakes your hand, they could suck the life out of you they could suck their life out of your destiny. They could suck the life out of your mind, your body, your soul, your spirit. They could even cause a transference into you. That's the number one reason why the Japanese do not shake hands. Go to Japan. Watch Japanese films. Look at the TV news from Japan. They do not shake hands. Because shaking hands is exposing yourself to an inherent danger. For, for those that, 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 that are not prayerful, for those that do not wait on the Lord in a secret place, for those who, who do not have the Holy Spirit with them 24-7, such people, when they shake hands with someone that has a negative aura, that negative aura sticks onto you. It transfers onto you. And if you are not prayerful, if the Holy Spirit is not with you all the time, it will take you 90 days for that particular negativity to wear off your life. And the next 90 days, you will be wallowing in, in, in disappointment, in bad luck, in accidents, in, in a lot of unspeakable, unspeakable circumstances. Be careful who you shake hands with. It's not everybody's hands you're supposed to shake. Some people you, some people you want to greet and just say, Hi, hi, how are you? Hey, what's up? Be modest. If you don't want to shake people's hands, when you, when you see them coming, make sure your hands you used to shake, you, you occupy that hand with something, so you wouldn't be able to shake your hands. And be expressive with your facial expression. How are you? Hey, oh, my man, what's up? What's going on? Good. No shaking hands. Because the more hands you shake, the more instability you, 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 you attract to your life. Shaking hands is dangerous. I've heard stories of people who were at the ends of their lives. And somebody went to visit them on their sick bed and shook hands with them. And when the person left, there was a transfer that took place. The person who was at the end of his life, he became well. And the person who came to visit died a few days later. A transfer takes place. Shaking hands. Your hands are one of the gateways to your soul, to your destiny, to your future. That's why you have people who are called palm readers. They look at your hands and they tell you your destiny, your future, what you're meant to be. Don't let anybody lie to you that what you don't know cannot kill you. It's a lie. Ignorance is not an excuse. What you don't know could very well be your end. So I hope you take these little nuggets of wisdom very serious. Stop shaking hands with everybody you meet especially if you are not spiritual if you are not prayerful if you are not waiting on the lord stop shaking hands it's deadly it's dangerous it could cause you delay it could cause you delay it could cause you disappointment it could cause you your life stop shaking hands <sighs> sorry for yelling at you <laughs>